Hurricane Alex barreling down on South Texas tonight. The storm spin off, forcing Central Texas into a flash flood watch. The threat of severe weather topping our news here at 6. Jim Spencer live tracking these outer bands and joins us from the First Warning Weather Center. Yeah, the outer bands moving all the way up here into Central Texas today. Some heavy downpours in Austin earlier, even though the hurricane itself is not even in Texas. It is located now the center of the storm, about 100 miles to the south-southeast of Brownsville. What an amazing set of images this is. This is the visible cloud view from space today. Just uh, an incredible hurricane there. Just a strong Category 1, but an impressive eye in the middle of the storm. Let's go to the latest on the storm now on the radar. Uh, you can see it's about 100 miles to the south-southeast of Brownsville. You can see the eye clearly in the radar presentation. Tornadoes being reported, flooding being reported up in the Brownsville area on South Padre Island, on Port Isabel. A lot of problems still to come down in the valley. And look at the widespread reach of this storm with the rain bands even making it here into central Texas this afternoon. And that's not the end of them. We have more rain in the forecast tomorrow, Friday, maybe Saturday too. Your first warning weather is coming up.